Tell me how this project started. What made you think to do this? So, yeah, I came back to Kiev after three months of the uh, while I was uh, on the east, uh, western part of Ukraine. Uh, I came back to Kiev and I saw the a planter of uh, this military construction throughout the city. Uh, and the uh, first idea was to decorate uh, some of them like a symbol of defending our culture, our values. But after that, uh, I decided that uh, drawing uh, on uh, Hitchcock's or uh, Protetankovi Yuzhiki in Ukrainian, uh, I can tell the world that uh, Ukraine is uh, alive and it will be a wealthy country and now we are looking the way to do so. Uh, in spite of war, uh, we are fighting and we know what we are defending. And can you tell me about the type of art that you're painting? I'm doing uh, and I'm painting uh, Ukrainian folk art. It calls uh, Petrikivsky Rospis. Uh, it's, uh, it is very traditional Ukrainian painting. It is made uh, with the special brush from the cat's fur. Uh, it's, uh, it is very thin. So, and I decided to do very, de very detailized uh, uh, painting to show how our Petrikivsky Rospis is uh, beautiful. What has been the, uh, the public response to what you're doing out here? Um, people are very thankful and grateful and uh, like what I'm doing uh, even more than uh, I thought I thought it will be so uh, it's it is very inspiring and uh, now I can even feel how it is important for people for Ukrainians uh, to continue to believe in our uh, that Ukraine will win uh, what, what were you doing uh, before you were painting here? Um, before the war and before my painting, I uh, had a firework business. We had 11 stores in Ukraine, Kharkiv, Kyiv and other countries. And we also made huge uh, firework displays. Uh, but now our business is out, so I have uh, free time and uh, I also I had a dream to paint a lot and now I have such opportunity, but the price is too high for that. Uh, do you have a message for Americans uh, about uh, the current situation or where you think things should be? The, my main message uh, for USA is that uh, give us more Heimers, please. Uh, we know how to stop the war, we need weapon to do that. Right. Do you have a message for President Zelensky? Yes, I have. Uh, I'm very grateful for our president and I wish him to find the way to stop the war and uh, to be our leader next five years. Well, thank you for your time. I hope everyone enjoys what you're doing and we appreciate it. Thank you.